This library video will help you with in-text citation using the Harvard Western CU style. When you refer to another person's ideas in your work, you can either quote it or paraphrase it. Paraphrasing involves putting the idea in your own words. It is usually better to put ideas into your own words as it shows you understand them. Here's part of a journal article. To paraphrase this text, I will put it into my own words, like this. Successful students actively participate in class. See how my version uses different words but keeps the idea I want to use. We need to link the paraphrased idea to the original source using an in-text citation. This journal article was written by Joanne Jaworski, Rosemary Weber, and Nabil Ibrahim. It was published in the year 2000. An in-text citation consists of the author's names and the date of publication as shown. To quote this text, it will look like this. A quote uses the same words as the original text, with a single quotation marks following the Harvard Western Sydney University style. The in-text citation for a quotation would look like this. When quoting, include the author's surnames, year of publication, and the page number. In summary, a paraphrase is in your own words. An in-text citation for a paraphrase includes author's surname and year of publication. A quotation has the same words as the original source. An in-text citation for a quotation includes author's surname and year of publication. It also includes the page number and the quote in single quotation marks. When quoting or paraphrasing, if the author's names are part of your sentence, do not include them inside the brackets of the in-text citation, as shown. Place the year in brackets directly after the author's name. And for direct quotes, include the page numbers. The reference list should be headed References. For each source you have referred to in your writing with an in-text citation, there must be a matching entry in the reference list. Jaworski, Ku, Monash University. References should be in alphabetical order of the first author in the reference list. The Harvard Western Sydney University Referencing Style Guide is available on the library website. For more information, please contact the library. Thank you.